What's good, you two? That one, I need to hear back again once again. It's Hippie. Today, we're back for another episode of our Pokemon Alpha Sapphire Let's Play. In the last episode, you guys, the last episode that you guys saw, we actually went and caught Suicune. I know uh, a couple of these Legends videos have been uploaded, uh, have been recorded and uploaded out of order. And, and all honesty, I wish we would have done it differently. But this is my first time ever, like, actually doing a Let's Play where we, uh, like, actively go and catch legendary Pokemon. So. I don't know, you live and learn, I guess, but either way, in today's episode, you guys, we're going to be attempting to capture the legendary Pokemon Dialga if you're playing Alpha Sapphire and Palkia if you're playing Omega Ruby. So, if you guys are hyped for today's episode of Alpha Sapphire, <laughs> and of course, you're proper members of the Nappy Nation, make sure you smash that like button down below for us because you already know your support is greatly appreciated now. First things first, what I need to do is, oh, our team is not looking all too good. Um, main reason why the uh, Legendary Beasts, you know, Entei, Raikou, and Suicune were uploaded before this, because Dialga and Palkia uh, were supposed to be uploaded before that. That's why, like, Suicune and whatnot, I said, like, episode 68 or whatever it was. Uh, the reason for that is uh, I actually recorded them ahead of time when I had the chance to do it. Like, I recorded them, I guess... At the same time, before I got all three of the, uh, 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 um, these, these little niggas right here, these little niggas right here, these little niggas, I recorded, uh, the capture of these three before these three, but, fun fact for you guys, in order to actually access the Alga or Palkia, depending upon what game you have, you actually need to have all three of the late guardians in your party. I know, right? It stacks, it stacks, it stacks, it stacks. So instead of waiting to capture Dialga and Palkia and then moving on to Entei, Raikou, and Suicune, I had the time, so I just went and caught those three. But, of course, they were uploaded out of order, and it was super duper sad, yada, 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 yada. So either way, we're gonna go ahead and scoop them up in our party. I'm just gonna go ahead and swap... I'm gonna swap these three out, because I feel like these are the best ones to take hits and whatnot for our team. So, with that, we have all three of those in our party. It does not matter what time of day, it does not matter what day of the week. That's the only prerequisite that you need. So, you gotta get, um, Azelf, Mesprit, and Yuxi. So, if you guys missed out on how to capture them, you can go ahead and go back a few episodes in the Let's Play. Playlist is linked in the description. You can check it out there, because those are very, very specific based upon the time of day, how to capture them and whatnot. By the way... Now that we have them in our party, we need to go ahead and call upon our private jet real quick. Like, some of you guys were asking, how come I don't just, uh, make the Eon Flute a key item? I don't know. I guess I just like clicking on it when we get to there and yada, 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 yada. I don't know, okay? Leave me be. Leave me be. <laughs> Either way, what we need to do is, oh, hello? What is this I see? What is this I see? I spy with my little eye. A Mirage Island. Ah. Um, some of you guys said something about I need to uh, check off Mirage Islands on the BuzzNav or something like that. Uh, I, I saw something in the comment section the last couple episodes about it, and I meant to go back and look at it before here just to get, like, get specifics on it. Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I think this is the one that has Poison Jam. I'm not 100% sure. I, all I know, all I know is I was talking to PK Sparks, and he was saying that he wanted to get the TM for Poison Jab. Oh, I don't have, I don't know if I have the right bike for this. I don't know if I have the right bike for this. I mean, I guess it'll still be here, so I can get it after we record this episode. So I don't, I don't have to have it at this moment in time. But apparently there was one of these Mirage Islands that had Poison Jab on it, and I think he said it appeared north of Moss Deep, and we're kind of sort of north of Moss Deep. Hello, Zeev Striker. Jesus Christ. I'm gonna need you to turn down. I'm not interested in messing with you right now. <laughs> That's all I'm saying. Uh, but I don't think I have the correct bike for this. I know you can get both bikes in the game. Oh, I do have the correct bike for it. Never mind. Never mind. But I'm guessing this is not the correct island to have a poison jab. I know we were just north of Moss Deep City. I guess we're not north enough. I guess we're not north enough. So either way, we're going to get back on our private jet and fly about here. Actually, I want to take a look at that BuzzNav stuff. Real quick, like, I want to take a look. I want to take a gander at that BuzzNav stuff and see if I can figure it out on my own, real quick, like, or if I actually need to go look it up, or if I need someone. I mean, I would call this north of Moss Deep, TBH, unless there's like, I mean, that's Moss Deep right there. I mean, it's kind of sort of northeast, but still. I mean, I mean, like, we, we're gonna be over here somewhere, like, cause now we're like directly north of Moss Deep. Oh, well, Shoal Cave is here. That's Shoal Cave up there. I don't know. We'll see. I'll do a quick 360 of the region and make sure we don't miss out on anything else. I can't even do this with the buzz nav. I have to land to access the buzz nav. Hold on. Land your happy ass down here. Latias. God damn it. 
See, this is the, this is the type of crazy shit I get into. All I'm supposed to be doing is capturing the Alga and Palkia today, and this is what I end up doing instead. <laughs> so hold on, let me see on the Buzz Nav here. Let's see here. No, that's the Dex Nav. Hold on. No wait, no, 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 no. I click on everything but the Buzz Nav. Jesus Christ. H and M yesterday, an astronomical event. Like, everyone was apprehensive. Let's check see if there's updated news available. I passed by new Mirage spot discovered. Uh, it just said I passed by 30 people. This 3DS has not left my house, so I am not exactly sure how Street Pass works. Uh, I've seen people like carry their DSs around with them at conventions and shit, and like I see Street Pass when people like walk past each other in that little that little mini game, and I like I ask people like, what the hell is the point in that? Oh, it's just Street Pass. I love doing this. I love doing that. And I'm just like, okay. Oh, hello, do you guys see that? That's where we're going to get Dialga and Palki. You guys see that over there? <laughs> okay, so we have a second island that has appeared here. Did we just land on Mirage Mountain? Or was this Mirage Island? Uh, I'm gonna land on Mirage Mountain. I, I feel like we just, didn't we just land on Mirage Mountain? Or am I bugging out? I feel like I'm bugging out right now. The names are so close to each other. I mean, if worse comes to worse, we just hop back on the private jet and just go. This is not the same one that we were on before. Ooh, hello, Mirage Mountain. And this does not look all too. Oh, god damn it! No, 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 no! <laughs> this does not look all too enticing. Cause again, now I feel like I definitely have the wrong bike. Cause I, if I got that soap, I had the mock bike. I need the acro bike to do acrobatics and hop around and shit. Then we ain't got that. Uh, I know you can get both bikes at the same time. Uh, we already spoke to one of the people that you need to speak to to get both bikes. So, we'll have to see what ends up happening here. Hopefully I can still get what I need to. I feel like I'm not going to be able to. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I, keep, I just keep rambling based off of things that I've heard. Not any actualities or any facts or anything like that. Because if I get on the bike... See, it's not gonna let me jump. It's not gonna let me jump across. Why is this even here? Why don't... Like, you're just being an ass, Game Freak. You're literally just being an ass. To have me jump across here. Whatever. So we're gonna have to come back. We're gonna have to come back. Once we have the correct bike, we're gonna have to come back. So by the way, let's actually finally do what we're supposed to be doing. Eight minutes into the video, and we haven't even done what we're supposed to do yet. So, let's head over to the giant fracture in the sky. This is where we just landed at, right? I feel like that's where we just landed at. No, whatever, I'll worry about it later. I'll worry about it later. I'll... Excuse me? Drifloon. Excuse me? And like, what the hell? What the hell is Slowbro even chilling on? What the hell is Kristen even chilling on? <laughs> just chilling on some air. I wanted to do just a quick uh, rundown, a quick recap of the region real fast. This island is still chilling over here. We visited, oh, 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 excuse me, evasive maneuvers. Mirage Forest, wait, 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 I don't know if we landed here before. I don't know if we landed here before or no. Or no, or no. I know there's been, there was an island, I think it was, was it Mirage Mountain that appeared over here before? Yeah, I don't think we, I don't think we've been here before. We don't have we don't have a rock smash Pokemon. Huh. We should still have a super repel up. And max elithers all uh, uh, elithers elixirs all we're getting. It's all we're getting. Huh. What the hell was that? I'm not interested. <laughs> I'll tell you that much. I'm not interested. I'll tell you that much. Either way, I'm just trying to check out all these Mirage spots and get them cleared off and whatnot so that hopefully we can get uh, Crescent Isle, I think is the name of it, where Cresselia spawns at, to appear. It's south of Moss Deep, so I think that's where we're going to go next before we head into the giant... Oh, whoa. Yo, can you hear it? Oh my god, it's so creepy. It's like... <laughs> oh my lord. Uh, here we're passing over Fable Cave again, and people have been like freaking out because we passed over it so many times that I haven't bothered to catch the legends that are over there yet. 
and people are like mad, like, oh my god, Navi, what is it? Just go capture whatever the fuck it is already. But we have our three Pokemon that we need in our party, the Lake Trio, so let's head into the giant fracture in the sky that's south of Duford here. Yo, this is creepy. Wait, wait! There's a huge gap in the sky. The area surrounding the gap is very quiet, as if time had somehow stopped. Do you want to fly into the gap? Not yet, not yet, not yet, not yet. Oh shit, I can't do this. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Duford Town land. <laughs> hold the phone. I want to say before we go in there, because you know the moment we go in there, that big ass yell is going to pop out of the ring and slam in the ground in front of us, and it's going to be on then. All right, Donkey Kong. And actually, you know what we need to do? We need to double check our Ultra Balls. It's a good thing we landed. We need to double check our Ultra Balls and make sure that we actually have enough. Uh, excuse me. We have 20 Ultra Balls. Oh my god. If we would have gone in there. And there's no Mart on this island, is there? God damn it! <sighs> you skank ass dude for town. Briny's over here, right? We haven't, we haven't hit up Briny. Briny's. Okay, Briny said fuck us. God damn it. <sighs> Give us just a moment. <laughs> Bear with me. I know I've burned so much time. It's been a few days since I played the damn game. And I'm just burning time like a motherfucker. My lord. We're going to catch Diago today. I promise you guys. I promise. I promise. I promise. I promise. Diago's brightening all the way the fuck up there, you conceited dick. Okay, take me over here. Take me there. I want to go there. And we're gonna save in New Mallville, not New Mallville, we're gonna save in Mallville after we get our Ultra Ball, so we don't have to worry about saving and do for anything crazy like that. <sighs> come on now. Come on now, come on now, come on now. Come on now, man! Give me some goddamn Ultra Balls. I apologize, you guys, for the delay, for the delay. Can I get 30 of these bitches? Let's go with 30 of them real quick so we have an even 50 in the bag. We should be good to go now. We should be good to go. We're going to save the game. There's only been one time that I actually went and re-recorded an episode of uh, this Let's Play. It was before we um, it was before we went and did the Primal Kyogre stuff. Like, back when we were still getting badges and shit. Like, directly after the Moss Deep City event and all that shit. Because I had to get a Pokemon that could learn Dive. And it took me like 90 minutes to find a Pokemon that could learn Dive. It wasn't actually 90 minutes, it was like 20 minutes in the episode and I still hadn't found a fucking Pokemon. I was sitting there fishing and I was like, this is stupid, I'm not uploading this. But I think we're good enough with this as of right now. Let's just fly in, we saved our game and everything. Let's go. Look at how intense this is! Oh my god. No hesitation. And the music starts! Oh my god! Big ass Dialga just lands! Oh my god, yo, I'm scared. I'm scared, y'all. I'm scared. Yo, look at how gigantic it is. Yo, IRL, Dialga is like 21 feet tall. He's one of the tallest Pokemon. This nigga is huge. This nigga is huge. Y'all don't understand. Y'all don't under- Roar of Time? Right off the bat, I see you, big dog. Doesn't Roar of Time has a- Doesn't that have a recharge rate? I feel like they could have done so much more for the animation for Roar of Time, to be honest. I really, really do feel like they could have. Uh, he's a Steel type, so I'm gonna go for a Psy Shock, and hopefully we don't kill him. Control yourself, Kristen. Control yourself. Okay. I don't know if we can go for anything. Yeah, he's got to recharge off that. I don't know if we can go for anything else with Kristen, however. Um, let's go out to Metagross. Let's go out to Metagross, and hopefully Metagross. I'm gonna Mega Evolve and Bullet Punch him. Because a bullet punch shouldn't kill him. A bullet punch shouldn't kill him. Even a crit. I feel like even with a crit, it shouldn't kill him. Definitely shouldn't kill him. Roar of Time again? You're going to tire yourself out, big dog. I'm telling you. Metagross, eat that up for me. You're going you gonna to tire yourself out. For real, big dog. For real, big dog. you about to... Oh, shit. I just dropped my pen. you about to tire yourself out real quick. But, I mean, you know what? That's good. Where the hell are my pen... Oh, there it is. I was about to say... It's a good thing if you tire yourself out. Because <laughs> that means you're going to be easy to catch, son. Son, son! Okay, catch this bullet punch. You want to catch these paws, nigga. I'm fine with doing that damage. I'm fine. He's got a recharge. I'm fine with just chipping away at him. Because unless he gets, like, the mother of all crits, or unless he's rocking, like, Fire Blast or some shit, which I feel Dialga, I feel like Dialga can learn Fire Blast. That was a crit. Oh, my lord. It's paralyzed. <laughs> la, 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 la. Okay, what I'm going to do right now 
is I'm gonna go back out to Kristen. Nice and regenerated, restored all of her HP. I'll take it. Just a... So I'm gonna go back out to Kristen real quick, like, and uh, just eat up hits and just start. He's got Aura Sphere. Wow. Wow. I like how they hit Kristen right in the fucking mouth, too. Shit. <laughs> pop Kristen right in the mouth. I didn't buy my Pokeballs in sets of 10. Damn it. All right, Premier Ball. It's all for you, big dog. It's all for you, big dog. JK. I guess you don't like Premier Balls. <laughs> He's got Iron Tail. What's your mixed ass move set? What's your last move? Iron Tail, Aura Sphere, Roar of Time. He's got to have some status move. Some status move is what is he? he's got to have his last move. I don't know. We'll see. We'll find out here in a minute. Here in a minute, big dog. I just need you to stay in the Ultra Ball. Really, nigga? Really, nigga? Really, nigga? Just don't struggle kill yourself. That's all I'm asking. That's all I'm asking. How many times do we have to struggle kill in this in this uh, Let's Play so far? I think we only had one. I think we only had one. I can't even remember what it was. What struggle killed itself? Was it Lando or Tredatus? It was one of those two. I think it was one of those two. Oh my god, how does that make you feel? We just juked and vibed and dodged that attack. I actually, you know, I'm gonna keep track of that. I'm gonna keep track of that right now. I'm gonna keep track of that. He's used three roar of times. What's he about to use? Flash Cannon is his last move. So he's all out offensive. Oh my lord. He's used Aura Sphere once. He used Iron Tail once. And he used, uh, what was that? Flash Cannon? God, with your mixed ass, my lord, once. Okay, so, oh, no, 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 we're not attacking, we're not attacking, we're not attacking. So, I'm gonna do, what I'm gonna do, uh, I feel like, I know Roar of Time, pretty sure Roar of Time, oh, wait, no, he missed it, didn't he? Did he use it four times? Come on, nigga, come on, man! And he's paralyzed, too, so that's good. That's the only downside, that's the only downside, like, paralysis versus sleep. Like, sleep keeps you 100% from using moves, whereas paralysis just has a chance because you might get paralyzed, you might break through paralysis. Only downside is paralysis is, for the most part, permanent. Unless you have aromatherapy or rest or something like that to, to clear it off, you can't just shake off paralysis, but sleep you can wake up from. So then you have to keep swapping out to a Pokemon that can put him to sleep. Whereas Thunder Wave, nigga, you ain't going nowhere, nigga. Nah, uh, nowhere, nigga. Stay in the ball, yo. Come on, man! You just paralyzed, yo. I'm sorry. I don't know what I did. Maybe I flew into your giant ass crack in the sky. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be upsetting you or nothing. All, I, all I'm asking, all, I'm just asking for one simple thing. I just. There goes another flash cannon. All I'm asking for is one simple thing, Dialga. I just, I just, I'm just asking for you to stay in the, in the ball. I'm just, I just want you to stay in the ball. That's all. That's all I really want. All a nigga really want is you. All a nigga really want is you. Dun, 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 dun. Yo, extra uh, brownie points, or whatever you want to call it, nappy points. <laughs> extra nappy points to anybody that gets the reference to that song. If you can name that song in the chat, in the chat, like we're live streaming, in the description, then uh, hats off to you, big dog. Hats off to you. But this nigga has not stayed in this ball for more than one shake. And you really starting to piss me off, son. There's two. Oh, there's two. Breaks out. Breaks out. Well, no, no, no. Is that, is that still considered one shake, though? Is that still considered one shake? Because he broke out after the second shake. He didn't stay in for the second shake. He just broke out. I don't know. All I know, dude, is you got you in the red. I can't lower your health no more. I need you to just stay in this damn ball. There's one. There's two. There's three. <gasps> You can't be playing with my emotions like this with your Aura Sphere ass. That's Aura Sphere number four, by the way. Yo, he's actually doing some damage. He's chipping away. He is chipping away. Big dog. I'd be surprised if you if you get us down to the to the red. I'd be surprised, motherfucker. Since he's hitting us with a whole bunch of special moves, that's why. We can't eat up special moves as well as physical moves. And we juked that one too. But still that counts. Either that's that's either his fourth or his fifth one. I can't remember if I counted the one that missed before. I feel like I did. If, if it did, then he has one left. If Roar of Time is only five, I feel like it is only five. Stop breaking out with your big toe ass. My lord, look at how big his toes are. Like, Jesus Christ, his toes are colossal. He be scratching that niggas. Choice Band is scratch Dialga. Can I run that in Ubers, nigga? Can I run that in Ubers, nigga? Take a nail file. Take a fucking grinder to them nails. There goes one. 
Oh my god, come on, dude. Oh my god, come on, dude. Flash cannon, yo. I'm just saying, I don't appreciate how you're not actually um, catching paralysis right now. I would really, really, really like it, and I really, really appreciate it if you would. Or if you just stay in the Ultra Ball. You know, it's tomato, tomato, whatever floats your boat. If I'm not mistaken, this is the 14th ball we've thrown at. It doesn't matter. I was gonna say, I guess it doesn't matter. Roar of Time? So, that, so I did count it. That should be his last Roar of Time right there. Ooh. That wasn't even a crit. You know, I think I'm gonna take advantage of the moves that we do have. Let's go for a slack off. Let's go for a slack off. Sorry, Diaga. Not this time, nigga. Not this time. Yo, but I will give it to him. I will give it to him. This has been the only legend that has actually dished out that much damage to Kristen. Out of all, all, all the le other legends that we caught, nobody ever took her down past the green. Come on! Why are you being such an ass? Why are you being such an ass? That's the sixth aura sphere. I'm pretty sure Iron Tail is 15 PP. Pretty sure Flash Cannon is the same. I'm pretty sure he's all out of roar times. And he's almost out of aura spheres. So I just need you to stay in this ball, big dog. <sighs> Nigga. Nigga. Get your flash cannon ass. You think all your moves that was a crit. You think all your moves would be physical, seeing as you got them toenails like that. Don't have me get back on your nails. Don't have me get started back on your nails again, son. I mean the chest piece is nice. The fender on your back is nice too. The head piece is pretty dope. I mean, I'm just saying. Yo, anybody ever notice that, like, that blue... It looks like a line of drool coming down Dialga's forehead. First of all, Dialga got, like, a 100 head going on right now. Look at that nigga's forehead. Look at that nigga's forehead as it goes all the way up. And he got, like, a line of drool coming all the way down the middle of it. I'm so done. Come on, yo. You really testing me. You, you working my nerves with these attacks, and you busting out this goddamn Ultra Ball, son, with your drippy drool ass. Come on, now. Yo, drippy drool ass. Drool alga. Especially, he'll be called. Oh my god, come on, yo. Another aura sphere? Nigga. Nigga. I like how, like, if, if you. What, next time you see the aura sphere animation, I actually look at his legs. Like, his legs and, uh. Like, uh. His actual feet don't ever actually move. The rest of his body moves, but his legs don't move. They don't leave the position they're standing in. Like, he's rooted into the ground or something. And there's two. Come on, big dog. Watch, watch, watch. He leans back and comes forward, and that's it. This is ninth aura sphere. We're, we're counting. We're playing the counting game. And we've used 21 Pokeballs on him so far. I think it's time that you stayed in this goddamn ball. There's two. Come on. Resorting to Iron Tails, I see. We'll eat those up more so than anything else. I think he has the most PP on Iron Tail, though. All I'm saying, all I'm saying is, I only bought 30 extra Ultra Balls, nigga. So you best make up your mind whether you're trying to stay in this goddamn ball or not. There's two. There's three. Hey, I'll take it. I'll take it. Ah, ah, I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh, I'll take it. Uh, 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 I'll take it. Meta gross good level 55. Meta gross good level 55. Said I take it. Said I take it. Said I said I said I take it. Said I take it. I'm gonna nickname him Five Head because his forehead is colossal. I feel bad because it's like the mighty Dialga and whatnot, but still, this nigga got a gigantic forehead. He got a gigantic forehead. Oh my lord! Look at that thing. Look at that massive forehead. <laughs> Should have named him Tyra Ben. Let me stop. Let me stop, let me stop, let me stop, let me stop. Okay, oh wait, hello? What is this? Mirage Forest has moved. What you doing, big dog? What you doing, big dog? What you doing, big dog? Oh, oh, oh. What you doing, though? So it's basically the exact same thing as before. It's just there in Pokemon that you can encounter here. Okay, so I mean, that's nice. It's kind of like their way of making up for the, um... Friend Safari, because you don't have the Friend Safari in here, because that's how you found, like, other exotic Pokemon that weren't native to the region. But now, with these different Mirage Islands, Mirage Forest, Mirage Mountain, and all that shit, um, you can encounter different Pokemon. Like, we caught Darmanitan on one of them. We saw Z-Strike earlier today. So it's like, it's just a different chance to catch uh, other Pokemon. 
And I still see that's Mirage Island. And wait, 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 wait. Was that the one that we saw before? No, it moved down a little bit because it was up there before. Yeah, it was up there before. And I just want to make sure there's no other red spots on the map. I'm not missing out on or anything. Because these are the two that we saw earlier. We need to go get the bike to uh, further explore these. We'll get the bike to further explore these, but I think for right now, we're going to go ahead and wrap it up. Let's go ahead and land in Sutopolis and check out the nature of our Dialga. Some people are asking, like, why why, why does Nappy care so much about the nature of his uh, of his Pokemon and whatnot? You know, like, does he use them for competitive? I, I, I don't use them for competitive, but still, we've had an incredibly lucky streak when it comes to nature so far in this Let's Play. So, I mean, it's just, I just, it's just interesting to see what, what we end up getting. That's all. So let's go ahead and check out our Dialga. What do we get? We have a mild Dialga. And I'm pretty sure that raises special attack and lowers defense. Um, I don't know how I feel about that. I don't know how I feel about that. I'm not sure exactly what Dialga runs. Like, um, like, where, where do we meet him? We met him soaring in the sky. I don't know exactly... A War Sphere is the most PP. I guess it's decent. I guess Diago wasn't made to like eat hits like you would expect him to, so I don't know. I don't know. Either way, I know we can go ahead and pop these niggas back in the box here and uh, finish up our team. So I don't know. Either way, with that, you guys, we're going to go ahead and wrap up today's episode of Alpha Sapphire. In the next episode, you guys, Seeing as we've obtained the Alga, and if you're playing Omega Ruby, you've obtained Palkia. We're going to take those two and obtain Giratina. So, if you guys enjoyed today's episode, and of course, if you guys are proud members of the Nappy Nation, make sure you smash the like button down below for us, because you already know your support is greatly appreciated. But with that, I'm going to get up out. You don't mean to Nappy Nation, too. I'm out.